Hello there, welcome to another episode of one-on-one coaching and in this one I'll give you the six steps to increase your desire. This is from chapter two of Think and Grow Rich and the six steps are number one, uh, determine a definite amount. In this case is using money as the example to set up a goal, but determine a definite amount, something like a thousand dollars. Then the second step is determine what you're going to give in exchange for this goal and give it's intended as the things that you're going to do not the things that you're going to stop doing or give up or stop eating or something like that this is not about giving up it's about giving what are you going to give your best effort 30 minutes um, your sweat and tears more money i don't know whatever it is this is about what you're going to give step three is determine a definite date the importance of the date is to give your mind a specific focus is to create urgency but it's not necessarily to judge yourself it's to have a specific date in mind a specific target to have your mind focus the energy on a specific direction (laughs) number four is determine a definite plan and this is about being specific with the actions that you're going to take in order to get to whatever the goal might be and realize something this is not about um, being extensive with the plan it's about having a definite plan it could be one step two steps three steps it could be half a step it doesn't really matter but you want to be very specific with it in terms of what you're going to give and the other thing that he says in that step is that you want to start at once whether you're ready or not and the whole point of that is because we are masters at procrastinating when we think we're not ready or we need to learn something new the the point of this is to get yourself moving in the direction that you want step five is really summarizing the prior four steps so you want to put all the all the steps together into one paragraphs or a couple paragraphs and step six is going to be to read that paragraph uh, in the morning once in the morning and once at night and while you're reading you want to see yourself feel yourself and believe yourself already in possession of your goal i would admit i haven't done this pretty well i fail at one of these steps but i'm working myself through it and it's important because the point of repeating yourself the statement of the goal and the things you're going to give it's important to remind your brain and you start developing the habits of moving in the direction that you want the importance of believing not just reading it but actually seeing yourself with the money or with whatever the goal might be to feel yourself with it and to believe yourself in it is what's going to create the level of vibration or energy in your body that will start attracting all these things towards you and it will start motivating you to get what you want so that's what I have for you today, the six steps. If you like it, subscribe, uh, comment, share, and uh, let me know what you think. Let me know if it's helping, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.